hello everyone welcome back in the previous video we learned that how we can uh, create the different files from this and render this into the master file right so now the time is to create two, two or three routes and add their path here and then i'm going to show you that how you can redirect from one route to another one so basically this is a uh, pretty simple so you can do this in your own way but i'm going to explain it to you because uh, you are the beginner so you can learn it to that uh, how you need to implement this into your project so here i'm not going to uh, open this view uh, by get i'm going to call this view so view is a, a helper which is you going to first accept the path so here i'm going to accept this dashboard right so you can uh, define auth slash dashboard and you can also add the prefix for this auth but i'm not going to do this here and then you need to call this uh, dashboard right so it's uh, located in the auth dot uh, you can also add this like slash but i prefer you to follow this dot convention because it's uh, going to tell you that oh, is your view exist or not but in this uh, view helper it's not going to display it's going to display with the get helper so auth dot uh, dashboard okay save this one and then let's go here and type uh, profile and here i'm going to open the profile okay save this one and uh, let's uh, now our two routes are working so i'm going to i'm going to add this into the hmm, where i'm going to add this out so i'm going to add them into the auth plane right okay so let me find the dashboard i'm going to basically uh, oh it's uh, now disappeared so now let me open this auth slash dashboard so it's going to now open our dashboard blade right okay it's uh, opening this dashboard and basically i want to add uh, add this uh, dashboard when i click on this dashboard so it's going to uh, redirecting this on the index.html so i don't want to redirect this on the index.html i want to redirect this on the dashboard right so how i can do this so now let's uh, go here and find the dashboard let me go there and pro find the proper place and yes this one is dashboard and uh, this index we need to replace with this one right so here you need to type mustache sign and then you need to call your route helper so you don't need to call this url because it's not going to suggest that this url exists or not right it's not suggesting us anything so that's why i prefer you to use this route here right so first we need to define these route name so then we are going to and we are going to be able to call this out right so auth dot dashboard dashboard okay and then you need to call this auth dot profile so name and then auth dot profile save this one and if i go to this auth dot blade dot php so here if i open this auth dot route and type uh, auth dot uh, dot dashboard so it's will going to suggest us that uh, why my text editor is not suggesting right now so basically it suggests us when you type uh, route auth dot dashboard so it's going to suggest that this uh, route exists okay so what's the next i want to also add this into this uh, forms i want to add this into the icon so i want to remove this so uh, ui okay remove this out and here in this icon and here i'm going to call this route and this now it's displaying so i can instantly select any of the routes and it's suggesting exactly what it's defined in the web.php right so you have this one and i'm naming this uh, profile okay let's save this one again and it's going to refresh this out and do uh, yes let me double refresh because we need to if it's changing is not applied on it so it's going to refresh and apply our changes okay okay it's going to open this out and here this is profile and this is dashboard 
right and yes it's opened and it's now highlighting this uh, localhost 8000 so you can take eye on this so left to bottom and yes if i go to this profile it's going to profile so if i click on this profile so it will be instantly redirected on the profile right it's redirected on the profile page right it's displaying running and if i click on this dashboards so it will be instantly returned back on the dashboard so in this way you can uh, create your routes and you can direct on the specific page and you can also render this master blade into every of uh, every of your files so hope you get an idea that how you can implement this out and i want to also show one more thing let me check the video size no it's not going bigger so in the web pack i want to improve this code right so how you can improve this so you can improve this like uh, adding the prefix so i will uh, i'm going to teach you that how you can improve this code so here i'm going to add the auth right why i'm adding this prefix so basically i want to i'm using this auth in the two uh, two routes i want to add this at the top so i don't need to reuse i want to reuse this out i don't want to copy this again right so now let's uh, cut this out so you can add the slash or you can ignore the slash it's totally upon you and just to remove these slashes remove this auth and then you need to define you define this author dashboard and author profile so you don't need to repeat this again so just to remove this auth dot and then auth dot and here you need to type a name or not name you need to type as this as is representing this name and then you need to type auth and remember here you need to add the add this dot because it's going to concat it's going to auth dot dashboard right and then here you need to group them uh, group and then you need to call the player and here you need to add this like this and then i'm going to cut this out and paste this into it so now it's also going to work so if i go here and give it a refresh so it's going to exactly work the same as it's doing the uh, as it's doing uh, before right so this dashboard is working this profile is working right so in this uh, by following this series you get an idea that how you can render your master blade or your any of the um, theme into the into your project and you also get an idea that how you can create different types of uh, how you can create a master blade and render this into uh, render your parent uh, render your child into the parents you also learn that how you can redirect from one route to another route and there are much things uh, much more things you learn this uh, from this series okay guys our series is completed and i want to ask a question that how much like you use in this series and uh, please rate your feedback that uh, what are the things which you like what are the things which should be improved in this series and also share your thoughts that what you learn from this series and uh, subscribe the youtube channel and uh, stay connected for these type of upcoming series so i will meet you in the next one bye, -bye.